Hello YouTube, in this video I am going to show you how to install CyanogenMod Mode 11 ROM on your Samsung Galaxy S3 i9300. This is the XD link of that ROM. You will get this link in the description below. This page is maintained by the developer Marcos89. So this ROM is powered with the Linear OS Saber Mode and full O3 optimizations. First go and download the ROM file from here, this link. So you can see the link here after that go and download the G apps as well you will get the G apps from link below okay here you can see these are the steps to installation and then here you can get the PAG apps so go and download G apps as well that is Google apps so i suggest you to download this pico modular package which only connects the google play, St play services you can uh, download from any of this link which will uh, weigh somewhere around 88 mb just go and download the, that g app as well you can find i only download those files i'll copy these files to my s3 now and uh, during the installation if you are facing any trouble here you can find a i9300 issues fixer.zip so if you are facing some boot loops or some troubles you can always flash this zip file as well so now i'm going to copy these files to my s3 here you can see i copied those uh, rom file and g apps to my s3 now i'm going to reset my phone to recovery mode i am using ttop app recovery if you didn't flash that one you will get a link in the video description to show you how to install ttop app recovery to get enter into TWAP recovery, you have to press volume up, home button and power button at the same time. Press and hold it until this locker comes, then release it. So you can see it's loaded into TWAP recovery. First you better take an Android backup of your current ROM. After that, go and do a factory reset wipe so that you can install a new ROM. Go back to the main screen again and click on install and then browse for the downloaded ROM file. So here is a CM11 download ROM file and then this is gapps first flash the CM11 ROM file. So you can see it's starting installing, you can see the progress bar down below, it will take some time. So the ROM installation is done, now go back to home again and then click here, click install and then from here select the gapps, download the gapps file, swipe to confirm. So the GB apps is also start installing. So the installation is done. Now click on the reboot system. You can see it's rebooting the phone. Here it shows the boot animation. Remember that the first boot will take some time. So please be patient. From here, finally is the installation with these settings. You have to configure your Wi-Fi and then Google account. I'll configure all these settings later. Okay, now you can see it's loaded into a new ROM. If you go to the settings, about phone can find I'm running on CM11 and uh, which is based on Android 4.4.4 .4. if you want to see the review of this ROM please check out the video description below that's it thanks for watching please subscribe for more